Get in the car. Who do you think you're talking to? I'm a member of the Coyote crew. I said get in the damn car. Well, okay. This guy fits the description, boss. He's wearing the logo you described. Let me have a look at him. Who are you? No way. The Vulture is a real person? I thought you were a myth. Yesterday I had a vision that a man with your jacket and your face came back in time to kill me. I want to know who you are. I don't know what you're talking about. I was at the clubhouse drinking beers yesterday. Maybe you're right. You know, working in the underworld means you have to be a little paranoid. Right, I get that. Then you know this isn't personal. Whoa! What are those bird freaks doing here? Someone told me they used to know Buttons in the army. I don't know what's going on here anymore. There's a rumor that Buttons was killed by the Vulture. That's because throwing people off of buildings is the Vulture's M.O. We're to bring him to justice. They tell me you're in charge around here. We should talk. You know, Birdman, I think we can help each other. You know, it's just weird knowing Buttons is gone, man. Yeah, Rodman ain't taking this very well. Buttons? I can't believe it's... You. That's for killing me in the future. <gasps> uh, I can explain. I don't understand. I just buried Buttons. Who the hell are you? Listen, it's really simple. I'm from the future where we all end up dead. I was sent back in time by God, who is an albino gorilla man. He wants me to make things right. How do we all end up dead? Alright. So I ditched Rodman, which made her crazy. She brainwatched Cheech to be an assassin who ended up murdering Birdman's partner. Yeah, you, Bird Boy. Birdman tracked us down and we all fought to the death at the airport. While Birdman was tracking us, the Vulture was gaining firepower and influence. After I died, the Vulture took his shot at Birdman and killed him. Two weeks after that, the Vulture assassinated the President of the United States, Our interference allowed the Vulture to become a domestic terrorist and bring America to its knees. We need to take him out while he's still just a mob boss. Joe, you were living in a shoebox! Look, I don't know who you are or what drugs you're on, but there is no albino gorilla god, and I'm afraid we're going to have to kill you for what you did to grapes out there. Oh boy, God, can you help me out? Hello, my children. 
Oh my god! Be still. I have a great deal of work ahead for all of you. Everyone in this room is my instrument and my creation. Even the two homosexuals. Wait, who, who are the two gay people in the room? It's not important. Everything Button is telling you is true. The vulture is a creation of the devil. He must not be allowed to live. Taking out the vulture isn't easy. If it was, I would have done it already. He's built a small empire in Los Santos. That is why I have given you each other. Now begin. So naturally, we started planning to take out the vulture. Birdman had a few ideas. So you're telling me we're going to trust Birdman's plan to steal the Vulture's drug products that we can't find, take the Vulture's money that legally doesn't exist, steal his weapons that he's sure to use against us, kidnap members of his inner circle that we can't identify, and then kill the Vulture who many people say is a myth, and after that, we're just going to walk away having saved America, but no one will ever know? Yep, that's how it's going to go. Let's get started. The product is cocaine. I was already doing some recon work and we were going to hit it soon anyways. Vulture runs a shipment of product every Tuesday and Thursday night from his warehouse to the city. The job is simple. We hit the supply line, stomp anyone in our way, and make the product disappear into the ocean. So what do you want us to do? Nothing. Busting drug dealers is our expertise. Alright, let's move out guys. God damn it, the Birdman is here. Get the product out of here. Who is that? Oh boy, we are in for a show tonight. Uh, boss, our contact never delivered the product inside the city. Witnesses say it was the bird guys. Uh, cost of running business, I suppose. We'll just change the routes. Uh, boss, there was another attack. Change the routes as many times as I needed. Ah, uh, boss.
uh, boss. So the cocaine lines were cut, which meant the vulture wasn't making as much money, and the cost of the business was stacking up. We were slowly bleeding him dry. Okay, the cocaine job's worked out, but it's time for step two. He still has the cash in every nook and cranny of the city. One specific nook is the Fleeka Bank. He's got a safety deposit box there with something special inside. I say we hit it. Robbing banks isn't my trade. This one is on you, Joe. Well, we tried to come up with a plan, but we're not master thieves. So we decided to just kick in the front door. Someone just robbed your safety deposit box at the Fleeka Bank. They have all the information to your offshore accounts. What is going on out there? Alright, listen up. I'm gonna give you some information and then I'm gonna walk away. The Vulture has a secretary that manages almost everything for it. She hides in plain sight, working a regular 9 to 5 from a small office in Los Santos. Now that we have access to his offshore accounts, we need to know where to go. My guess is she'll know. Do with that what you will. Kidnapper? Kidnapper. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Let me just get my insurance! Drive. It was clear that we were beating the vulture and the new timeline would be much better for all of us. But I had one personal matter to take care of. I just got the call. The secretary gave us a lot of information. Great! Coming to the observatory was such a great idea. It's such a nice day. You know, Rodman, one of my biggest regrets is abandoning you. Things could have been so much different for us. For all of us. What exactly happened to us? Well, you went nuts and Cheech ended up shooting you in the head after Sister Josephine failed to kill you with her car. Wait, what? And then I just left your body there. So on that note, I'd like to make things right and finally make an honest woman out of you. Rodman, will you marry me? Surprise! No! Ah, Rodman, what the f Oh, sorry. I thought you were going to attack me or something when you came out of the bushes. No, I was proposing to you. Joe was going to take pictures of you. Okay, in that case, I will marry you. Can nobody love you like I'm loving you, baby? Cause they don't know how to love you like I do. Can nobody love you like I'm loving you right now? Cause they don't know how to love you like I do. I love you like I'm loving you right now. Cause they don't know how to love you like I do. Can't nobody, Can nobody kiss you.
Well, we got what we needed from the secretary. All networks linked to the Vultures account were held inside a private building on the coast. But the secretary gave us more than that. She told us the Vulture keeps a special weaponry in a shipping container at the docks. The network job was easy enough. Birdman used a friend to hook us up with some high-tech gear and sent us on our way. All we had to do was infiltrate the building after hours, upload a virus, and drain all his bank accounts in a matter of minutes. The shipping container could only be accessed during daylight. That was a bit more of a problem. How do we steal a storage container in broad daylight? There's a way, but I can't be part of it. The military has a helicopter that can lift heavy objects. If we secure the container, someone could fly over and snatch it. Everyone wears disguises. We all act like we don't know what's going on. So Birdman gets us a helicopter, but we need someone who knows how to fly it. I know a guy. He was a private pilot from, for some rich snobs a while back. One day, they take off from the Midwest and head for Los Santos. Somewhere along the way, some birds flew into the engine. Wait, I think I heard about this. Oh, everyone heard about it. Sully, I think we lost an engine. Warning. The birds did it. Warning. Warning. We're going to have to make an emergency landing. The airport is ten minutes away. I don't think Warning. we have ten minutes, Miles. Warning. We're losing altitude. Sully, what do you want to do? Warning. Hang on. Sully? Sully? I said hang on. I don't know how you did that, but I love you, man. I love you too, Miles. So he's a hero then? No. After the crash, it was discovered that he was high the entire flight. They took away his license, and he and his co-pilot were never heard from again. But I know where to find him. You think he'll do it? I'll see what I can do. The time came for us to bring the vulture to his knees. We were going to pull two heists at once. On one side of the city, Joe and I were going to bash our way into the vulture's network and drain his bank accounts. On the other side, Cheech was leading the job on the armory container. We still didn't know what was inside. I found the Vulture's container. It's got the right logo.
What is that guy doing? That container belongs to the vulture. Can you believe this guy? Get on to us. We need to get out of here right now. We're done heading for evac. Smoking up here. Not gonna make it out. I need to drop this thing. Put him on the boat! Go for it, man. Come on, son, you can do it! Steady, steady. What happened with the armory, Rats? Something went wrong, Buttons. We lost contact. Oh, no! Don't worry. You're not going to jail. I've got special plans for you. Oh, you're screwed, bro. Hey, look! Gluten-free hot dogs. What happened? Is everyone okay? No. We lost a lot of people buttons, and Taz went missing somewhere along the way. I don't understand. How could this have happened? Oh yeah. I forgot to mention that some things about the past cannot be changed. For example, Tazzle's always going to betray you. 
My bad. God is a jerk. You made the right choice, Taz. We can help each other out. All right, gentlemen. It's time to exterminate what's left of the Coyote crew. We had no choice but to abandon the clubhouse and disappear. Now that Taz was on Vulture's side, there was nowhere to hide. Anyone with a Coyote crew jacket on was a wanted man, and many didn't make it. Has anyone heard from Rats? He got hit at the convenience store the other day. Damn. That's it? We're all that's left? There's still Cheech. If we had him, the old gang would be back together again. What do you mean? In the old timeline, you, me, Cheech, and Josephine were the only ones left. He matters to the crew. What are you saying? You want to free Cheech from the Vulture? The way I see it, we can't beat the Vulture anymore, and we can't wear the crew colors anymore. But we're still the crew if we have Cheech. That's right. Wow, you guys really have changed. At least you know you'll be going to heaven together when this plan fails and you all suffer painful deaths. Thanks, God. We appreciate it. Oh, no problem, buddy. You guys take care.
Despite God's motivational speech, we decided to go through with the plan anyway. The first thing we did was bring Sully back in the fold. We would need his flying expertise. Birdman has found Cheech. The Vulture has been interrogating him on a rooftop in broad daylight. It's pretty ugly. My idea is to use an attack helicopter that Birdman has a connection to. We blast the roof away while Cheech jumps on. Later we ditch the chopper and disappear for good. If we're lucky, the Vulture catches a bullet in the mayhem. Let's do it. I know there aren't many of your friends left. Tell me where the rest are, and you and I can put this ugly incident behind us. What are you gonna do this time? Throw me off the roof? Well, I don't want to, but it's kind of my thing. You? How can this be? Sorry, bro. I'm trying to find my car keys right now. This is kind of taking a long time. I'll never let you win, Vulture. Let me? Who are you? I'm Birdman, and you just killed my partner. It's over. We got him. Are you okay, Cheech? What did he do to you? Yeah, I, I just... I don't want to talk about it. Where to next? Well, it's nice weather out. I don't think the Vulture will mind if we borrow his yacht for a bit. What do you guys think? <laughs> uh, ah, yeah! yeah.